Hi there, this is Jamie Sorensen here at Two Peas in a Bucket with another video for our CHA online social. The theme this year is um, Winter Runaway. So we are showing you the latest trends and this video is sponsored by Cosmo Cricut. So we have a few collections from them to show you. So let's get started. The Social Club collection from Cosmo Cricut is really fun in that it was designed with inspiration from figures like Frank Sinatra and Dean Martin. It has a lot of retro flair to it and um, just old classics as well as kind of a good times um, nightlife feel to it. Um, you'll see this peacock feather and um, olives and martini kind of icons throughout it. So let's get started by looking at the 6x6 pattern paper pad. I think the color palette is a really interesting one with this nice rich deep teal and then the other shades of green, kind of a mint green and an olive green mixed in. And then it this red that kind of is a red orange that just really pops. In the mini deck they have 36 sheets so you get a few patterns of the different designs. Again nice retro feel, very funky and just different and fun. I like this polka dot has a lot of different patterns within the circles nice diagonal dotted line. This ledger, I think they've done this before, that's always great. And then here we have the olive. Okay, so that was the 6x6 paper pad. The buttons that um, coordinate get a nice mix. I've taken them out of the package so you could see the way they just pop against the black. And then over here on the dress form, I've laid out the die cut pieces that go with the collection. Get a nice mix of different shaped flowers and butterflies and that great color scheme. And then one of the alpha chipboard sets that they've come out with that I think matches well with the um, both the salt air and even the social light. Um, it, it's got this nice gradient fill within the letters. It's called Faded Blue. Then before we move on to the next collection, I want to make sure and show you the um, Social Club cardstock stickers. While it has those themes that I mentioned, you're certainly not limited to them. It has words and phrases like cool and daydream with nice uh, just basic label stickers and tabs. And then it does have um, some of the, the olives and the martinis that I mentioned. All right, so moving on now to salt air. It's kind of this nostalgic, summery, whimsical line that has a lot of um, mermaids and bubbles and different ocean fun summery things. I see these bubbles a lot and I think this pattern with the different waves in whale tails is, um, or fins, it's not a tail is it? I don't know. <laughs> Um, it's really fun and then this great, I love the wide um, stripes on this, it reminds me of a beach towel. Kind of looks like seashells. The Cosmo Cricut Patterns has a nice cream background, I'm sure you Cosmo Cricut fans know that. Um, and so the patterns just have a nice warmth to them. 
Here's more of the bubbles, but this time it has all the colors in it. Kind of looks like sand there. And I think this one they're calling Sea Garden, and I have a feeling it will be a favorite. It's just this really vibrant, bold um, pattern that you just can't help but be drawn to. More of that seashell, but in all the colors. More of those bubbles in that same bolder pattern. If you want it in one color, you have it. All right, so that was the Salt Air Mini Deck. Here are the buttons that coordinate. They've dyed them to perfectly match the collection. And they come in a different, a few different sizes. And then here are the die cut pieces that again have the different florals and butterflies. The cardstock stickers that match the salt air Turn the camera here, I'm sorry. Gives you nice journaling prompts just for you. Remember when those mermaids that we see, and then here is the chipboard. And again, you can see here in the, the splash, but they've done like a nice gradient. And in the mermaid's hair, um, it just lends itself well to an ocean theme. Okay, the last collection here that I have is called Upcycle. And it was made with the kind of girl in mind who I think many of us are drawn to um, just digging for treasure and finding fun vintage items and repurposing them in a cool way. Um, so it's called Upcycle, and I think that's a great name for a collection. So let's look at the mini deck here. Has nice aquas and pinks and creams in this collection. I love the alphabet set and how they've put all the alphas on one pattern. It also has this great yellow and gray, and then a different kind of girly images like um, purses and and girl figures and things like that. Nice ledger. Here we have a cool floral motif and then they've even put in some purses in there and I like that some of the images look collaged like they've used old dress patterns and advertisements and um, here's a lot of that where they've collaged different items together. More of the pur purses. This one I think is going to be a favorite and I think it's super fun. I love all the patterns and the circles and they've not just made it a circle pattern or a polka dot but there's this great layering look to it. Nice basic grid. Here's your polka dot. That same pattern but in a tone on tone design. More of the diagonal dot and graph. Give you a lot of great basics. And then here's um, the woman figure that's used throughout. Okay, this collection has the buttons as well in, great, in a great variety of sizes. The die cut pieces. The um, sea, I'm sorry, salt air collection, the butterflies had a gradient to them. In this collection, as well as the social club, the little butterflies actually have a pattern to them. So if it matters to you, the pattern, the style, and the butterflies, um, you want to note that. I think it's great that this collection has, it uses the phrase, I found you, throughout it. Um, because of that sort of vintage retro theme um, but also it just works really well for um, other themes like a romantic theme or something else.
All right, so those were the cardstock stickers and the chipboard. It gives you a great mix of all those elements that we see throughout the paper. And that was Cosmo Cricut. For your chance to win a prize pack of this product, please leave a comment on the event blog post by Sunday evening the 30th. We will be announcing the winners on Monday. Thanks for watching.